All right, thanks, Eileen. Well, before that Arctic air blows through our area, again, we may be dealing with the first measurable snow of the season. KWWL's Justin Andrews live in Iowa City. Justin, now you spoke with street crews there. Are they ready for this? Well, Bob, just days ago, about 2,500 tons of salt was delivered here to the streets department here in Iowa City. That's about 1,000 tons more than last year. But Iowa City crews tell me with the chance of us seeing the first measurable snowfall this upcoming week, that could potentially be a problem. Gary Davison is gearing up for even the smallest winter weather that could come our way. Trying to get my snow fence up before it snows. You just lay them out here, freeze my fingers off doing it, so I'm ahead of it a little bit. He does it every year, so winter's winds won't cause snow drifts along his driveway. It's too early. It always is. Too early, says Davison, because autumn's colors, the yellows, browns, and oranges, are still visible. But there's one more color we could potentially see white thanks to an early snow. You live in Iowa, you put up with it. Iowa City Public Works Director Rick Fall says the snowfall could present a problem for crews. Well, these early snows can be problematic for us uh, because of our leaf vacuuming program. We use the same trucks to vacuum leaves that we do for snow plowing. Iowa City crews tell me they will be tossing this salt mixture along the roadway if need be. I'm in no hurry for it to get here. Fall says there are about 13 trucks on their fleet. 12 snow routes. Currently, the vacuum pump equipment is on them, but he says city crews will be watching our forecast closely so they can place these snow blades on their trucks if needed. 2,500 tons. Just last week, about 2,500 tons of salt mixture was delivered. Falls tells me that's about a thousand tons more than last year. It comes when it comes, I guess. It could wait a little while. I'm not in a big hurry for it to get here, but. Now, Bob Fall says it takes about an hour to convert or to take off those vacuuming equipment on those trucks to put those snow blades on them. He says they usually don't convert all 13 of their trucks to those snow plowing trucks until the week of Thanksgiving. We've got you covered live at the Iowa City Streets Department tonight. I'm Justin Andrews, KWWL News. Yeah, it seems very early for snow, but you got to be ready. That's one thing we know living in eastern Iowa. Well, Chris.